It's true. I was a fat guy. What's up, everybody? Welcome to another vlog. It is a beautiful day, and it's the perfect day that I want to share my weight loss secrets with you. So I want to share these tips and pointers with you. What I went through, what I really did. If you're watching this video, probably you are looking out to lose some weight or something like that. So keep watching, and I hope you enjoy the video. 90 subscribers and counting i am so happy thank you so much guys if you haven't subscribed to me already you can just click down there and, or a like or a comment leave your comments i would love to know what you guys think ask yourself this very simple question why do you want to lose weight if you want to lose weight to impress someone or uh, you know for some other lame reasons or anything like that don't do it because you will fail horribly but if you really want to lose weight and you want to lose weight and, and surprise yourself, prove it to yourself and challenge yourself, go for it. So this was me two years ago when I was really fat. I, I had a big stomach, I had like a huge swollen chubby face. I decided to take up a challenge. Why did I do it? I, I did it because I wanted to <clears throat> challenge myself to see if I could actually pull it off, if I could actually lose weight. Any of my friends will tell you that I was on the plumper side. So I used to tip the scales at about 102 up to about 103 kilos. Then I decided that I want to change the way I eat. So at 103 kilos, it was not good for my health, no stamina, I couldn't run properly. Um, I was lazy, I felt tired, I felt exerted all the time. It was, it was not a nice feeling that I really wanted to have. Of course you can cheat. You have to cheat when you diet. You can't just strictly make your body go from here to here. It's it's not possible. So definitely cheat. I used to cheat uh, probably once a week. Yeah, once a week I would go out and eat anything I wanted in as much quantity. Your body needs to be surprised. You should always be surprising your body. Here are some of the foods where you really cannot touch while you are trying to lose weight. No, I have never been to a gym in my life. Point number one is I ate healthy. I cut all my bad carbs. I cut sugar. Sugar is the main killer. If you can eradicate refined sugar from your life, nothing like it. I mean, it's a miracle to step number one. White sugar, refined sugar is really bad. You have no idea how, how much poison. Stay away from white sugar. Rice, white rice is absolutely fine. Once in a way, if you have it in the afternoons. Brown rice, much better. So I quit sugar, I quit rice, I quit white bread, I went on to multigrain and brown bread. Um, and, I, and for us Indians, it's very tough. You see, most of our food is full of masala, full of oil. It's got all unhealthy stuff. It tastes great. Believe me, I love Indian food. It tastes super. But the second biggest thing I did was I decreased the amount of quantity that I used to eat. So if I would eat that much, I brought it down to that much and put one night and starve myself. So the trick here is if you're having three meals a day, breakfast, lunch and dinner, you split it. Try having about six meals a day, it really helps. If you can do that, nothing like it. Switch to salads, guys. It's it's much better, it's much healthier, it keeps you light. The moment you have a, a nice plate of butter chicken or paneer masala and rice and then you're like, oh, you know, it's it kind of drags you down your entire day. Green tea, green tea is very important, but I kind of went and overdid it. I used to have five cups a day. Do not have five cups a day. Two cups a day of green tea is perfect. It's what your body needs. But now there's a way of having green tea. The, this is what I used to do. You can try it out. So I used to get up in the morning and the first thing I would do without even brushing my teeth was make a cup of green tea and have it off there. Basically, in most of us, our eyes are bigger than our stomachs. So if you see, we, we don't really proportionate the amount of food that we're supposed to take. So we end up feeling uh, like sick. We end up feeling, oh, you know, I've eaten, I'm, I'm so happy. Oh, like, but no, trust me, that's really bad. The trick is if you can get up from the dining table feeling just a little bit hungry, just a little bit hungry, you know, that's the goal. Exercise. Exercise is very important. Push-ups, squats, you can uh, buy a couple of dumbbells and keep them at home. Use them. Sit-ups. Sit-ups are, are great. Crunches, perfect. Go for a run. Go for a jog. If you're too fat to run, don't bother. Start off with a walk. 
nothing like a little bit of work. Play, play your favorite sport. Uh, play football. I, I played football. I played a lot of football. I did a lot of running. I still go every day to the race course for a quick jog. For a, sorry, that was my phone. For a quick jog. It's good. It's good for you if you can do that. Try fresh juices. Fresh juices are the best thing you can, and you can do it at home. You know, uh, simply just cut a couple of. Uh, whatever you like and just throw it in the mixer and you've got a crazy juice concoction ready for you. Stay away from lazy people. Lazy people tend to have a crazy effect on you and then you in, in turn turn out to be lazy. You get fat. You just get fat from being lazy. Get off your butt and go do some work. So this is how I finally looked after I uh, lost. There are a couple of mistakes I did which I don't want you to do is I did not exercise. When I mean exercise, I did not lift dumbbells or do push-ups or anything like that so in 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 the bargain my shoulders kind of went in and um, i became really skinny actually i had people asking me that you know what are you are you doing drugs or <laughs> do you have some disease or something like that uh, so while you're dieting i suggest i highly suggest that you uh, use use some weights lift some weight the only thing that will get you through this is if you have enough of willpower to to get past it if you want something you got to go get something it's it's as simple as that life works that way it is that's how life is so i'm going to leave a little uh, note in the description right down on what exactly i i stopped and what i started to eat so you can use that as a reference see if that works for you so if you really like this video subscribe please share the video um there's no harm in sharing it it's it's free of cost share the video so other people who were like me can you know find a, a new path to their life so i hope this video has helped you guys i mean leave your comments down below i would love to know what you think feel free don't copy it but yeah share it and subscribe guys thank you so much